Hi guys, welcome back. In today's video, we're going to be doing an activity that is related to image recognition on how do computers recognize image. So we're going to be coming on this site called machinelearningforkids.co.uk. So we're going to go to your project, make a new project, which is going to be current cup, and it's going to be recognizing images. Then you're going to go in your projects like over here, click on it and come in train. Now you open a new browser and make it sideways to this machine learning page. Then you drag and drop images from there to here. So car images will be of car and cup images will be of cup. Then you're going to click on back to your project and click on learn and test. In learn and test, if you scroll down, there will be train new machine learning model. You will have to click it and wait till it trains. If your machine learning model takes time, you can always scroll down and answer the quiz that is below. Then after it's done training, you can test it whether it is learned well or not. If you're not satisfied with the example, you can always go back to train to give it more example. Then you're going to go ahead in make and click on scratch tree. It will tell you that this project will add these blocks to the scratch. It will look something like this, except with the name of your project. So now we're going to open in scratch tree and go in project templates. You're going to click on images project and get car and cup, car or cup. It might take a while for the template to load, but if it's not loading, then you will have to go ahead and select it again. And as you can see, it loaded. It's the mystery, mystery. So now what we're gonna do, we are gonna go ahead and update this code. So when green flag is gonna be clicked, we're gonna change item by one. And if the item is more than, uh, less than 23, then we're gonna switch costume to item show, go to front layer like this. So what do we need to update is that we need to put an if then else block. So we're gonna go to control, get the if then else block and put it over here. Now what are we gonna do? We're gonna remove that change y by x and this, we're gonna remove it, keep it on the side because we're, we're gonna need it later. Then what are we gonna do? We're gonna add an operator which is going to be equal to. So recognize co image, costume image label is gonna be equal to car. So how we'll do that? We'll go to operators, drag out the equal to sign, go in car and cup, recognize image we're gonna go in images get costume image put it over here and it is gonna be recognizing car so if it's gonna be recognizing car then what it is gonna do it is going to glide one set to pick random you know from some area so we're gonna go in motion and glide one sec we're gonna get this so what are we going to do? We're going to go ahead in operators and pick random and put it in the first blank, which is going to be X. What we're going to write in inside, we're going to write minus 210 to minus 100. So it's going to be minus 210 to minus 100. And Y, we're going to go in variables and get Y over here else what's it gonna do we're gonna go ahead to motion and get this glide one sec again and inside it we're gonna do the same thing like pick a random something so in here what we're gonna do we're gonna go to operators and pick random 100 to 210 and y is of course is gonna be y so we're gonna drag out it out of the variables and keep it over here now what are we gonna do for the for the block that we've keep kept aside we're gonna go you know when the other green flag click script over here 
So it seems like we will not be needing this, so we are going to delete it. Now our code is updated, then what are we going to do? We are going to click the green flag to test it out. So this is going to be car. It's going to go to this side. We're going to go in the, you know, our mystery, go ahead in costumes. And as you can see, there are a lot of pictures. So for now, I'm going to click on cup. And uh, so what we're going to do, we're going to switch costume to the item, which is a wearable. So if I keep this out, I am going to go ahead and switch costume to mystery number two. Will it be able to recognize it? Let's just check it out. And as you can see, it's a cup, so it's going on the right side. I'm going to click on mystery number four, which is a cup. It's going on the right side. If I click on mystery number three, it's going to be a car and it will go on the left side. So my project is working well and do tell me about yours too. Now we're going to drag item and keep it back inside over here. So our machine learning model is working well means it un has understood from our training data set. Remember to subscribe to my channel for more videos like these and in my next upcoming video we are going to be doing another activity about image recognition so i'll see you then